What's up fam? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Bizmatic and I'm back with another review for y'all, all right? Uh, this time around, this time around we got Triumph with Lay It On The Line, right? I did do one review from Triumph before, so go ahead and check that out. So I do have an idea of, of what the band sounds like. So I can't wait to, um, this is a video, no lyrics. This is a video. <laughs> Can't wait to watch it, man. Let's go ahead and enjoy it. Don't be scared. Hope y'all feeling great, cause I'm feeling great. Let's go. Oh, the double neck guitar. This about to be a I wanna love you, I wanna make you mine Won't you lay it on the line I'm tired of playing foolish games I'm tired of all the young lives making me insane I don't ask you for much, the truth will do just fine Ballad, 80s ballad, a lot of bass line, drummer going crazy. You know what's crazy? Every time I see a double neck guitar, I just feel like, you know, that's that's such a boss move. It just makes you look better than anyone else. Even if, you, if you're not even going that crazy on it, it just says, <laughs> look, I am way better than all of you. Every single one on this stage, I'm, I'm just better, all right? My guitar got a guitar. Like, I'm fucking better than all of you. Peasants. <laughs> that's that's what it says to me. Uh, nah, dope, dope, dope. Lot of guitars. The vocals is amazing, 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 amazing vocals, man. Amazing vocals. Yo, what y'all think? Eighties bands have had better vocalists than than the seventies. Nah, nah. Let me not even say that because because the seventies got Freddie Mercury. Um, the seventies got. Uh, who, 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 oh, damn. Was Steve Perry 70s? When I say 70s, I mean, what, well, uh, those, those were 60s. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, but the 80s had some great vocalists. Like, all of these, these bands, I don't know if this is considered to be hair, hair metal, I don't know. Uh, all of these bands that were doing all these ballads in the 80s, they had great, great fucking vocals, uh, I might be wrong. So one of y'all might be like, nah, this ain't the 80s. This is the 70s. I, I don't know. But dope, 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 dope track. Dope, dope, dope track, man. Uh, this was probably burning up the radio. <laughs> burning up the radio. Great times.
bro. Some of these things these people be wearing, bro, like that pink whatever that is what is that i don't know what that is that looks like it wasn't even meant for a human to wear <laughs> it just yeah what's the idea i felt like what he's wearing was something else <laughs> and then it just ended up being that it's like all right fuck it. we're just gonna cut off the top ah oh, shit we cut off too much uh, that's what it is now it's like what why oh my goodness but Though vocals, it's kind, of, it's kind of like he's singing in, in, in a falsetto the whole time, you know. <laughs> that, that, that part was just hilarious. But but um, amazing guitars, man, amazing guitars. That was that was a power ballad. That's what I call that. Yeah, that was that was a super power uh, um ballad. And for y'all, that's about to bitch about me roasting <laughs> his outfit. I don't care. I do not care. You know, you know that was a poor, a poor choice. You, you know it. I don't care. It was a poor choice. <laughs> He's dope on the guitar, though. Dope song, man. Amazing, amazing song. But I will not stop laughing at the goofy outfit. I will never, <laughs> ever. I vow to never stop laughing at it. Uh, yeah. It has nothing to do with the review, though, man. Uh, dope, dope, dope track. Uh, amazing instrumentation. Uh, whew, it, it was just fire, man. There ain't nothing else to say about the song. The song was fire. Yeah, and, and I think that's the second one I did from Triumph. So, y'all let me know what's next from Triumph. Uh, I would definitely check it out. I like the vocals. Uh, yeah, I like the vocals. I, I like the song. Um, y'all let me know how you feel about it in the comment section below. And also, if you made it this far, please hit the like button. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed. Join the squad. We'll be happy to have you in, you know. Yeah, as you know me, every time I'm out here, I'm laying it down on the line. See why I did that? So, yeah, I'll see y'all in the next one. And guess what? Y'all better be there. Peace.